channel. Yes, I have my other half back. This is Faith and, and Richie. Richie. And we are here to continue on our technique in our partnership dancing. So what are we going to work on today? Poise and posture. Wow. Sounds kind of important, right? <laughs> We can dance with a bad posture, you guys. I don't know if you've seen this out there, like the development of humans after monkey. Uh, last one is dancer. So we should better stay up straight, right? <laughs> More than even normal humans. So we really can't dance if we have a bad posture. Because we are not humans, we are dancers, right? Exactly. So every day in your everyday life, remember, you are still a dancer. FNR Dance Life Dancer. So we want you to stay nice and tall. I can't connect with my partner if I'm not connecting with myself. <laughs> so I really want you to do these exercises with us. Please get off your computer screen, your phone, your couch, join us in those exercises. Let's jump into our office. So first thing I want you to do, check points. Turn to the side. Look yourself in the mirror or look with us and try to match that shape. Put your legs together and I want you to straighten your knees as much as you can. Bring your hip bones forward towards your toes. So we want to be really as forward as possible, slightly forward weighted. And we want our rib cage and our hips to not be away from each other. We want to close them together. So we really feel our centers. Our centers should be very, very, very strong. Our coaches used to hit us in the center as little kids all the time. You need to have a really strong core. On the belly button, don't forget to press the bell button. Like and subscribe. Bell button for the belly button in. So we really want to keep that in. We want to make sure that we keep a strong center. If not, our spine has that natural S shape and we can't dance or move our hips like that. So keeping our center strong and close is very important. Now, our breast and chest is actually gonna be very naturally up and elevated. So we wanna feel like, I can take a deep breath. So we are really- Turn them up. Yes. Positia vine politia. <laughs> so we really wanna keep very, very nice position, confident posture, and compress our shoulders down. Imagine like somebody is pulling your arms down. So your shoulders are really actually connecting with the floor. And then our neck needs to do the exact opposite. Our neck needs to feel like somebody's actually pulling us up. So we have that feeling that we are stretching our spine as much as possible. Most of the problems start in the spine, all these back pains and everything because we don't elongate our spine. So by doing this exercise, you can actually join us and avoid a lot of health issues in the future by being aware of that posture. A very, very good exercise to do is actually use a wall if you have one, and then we are able to go against it. So we are literally gonna check all these points against that wall. So heels together, touching the wall, booty in and closing our hips to ribs and chest nice and tall, shoulders back. We don't want to slouch the shoulders forward. The shoulders are touching the wall and then I elongate the last piece of my spine with my head to elongate that. So why don't you play a game? I'm going to have the worst posture that I can. I'm going to stay sideways and you are going to fix my position. Let's see. I wish I was there to do that for you too, guys, but he's the lucky one. <laughs> so rotate, strong legs, amazing muscles, hip bones, forward, closing the center, chest up, shoulders down, elongating the neck. And he just grew two, three inches, I think. <laughs> I wish. So that is great. So now, how we can practice this posture? Because doing it once in the video with us is not enough. Every day, in your everyday life, examples. You wake up in the bed. If you lay down for me really quick. He just woke up. We want to make sure before we even stand up from the bed, boom, we take our posture. Straight up, close the core, boom, <laughs> center in, shoulders down, checking everything, perfect. So we are aligned with the bed. Now we wake up, we wake up, 
Come on. Wake up. Wake up. Wake up. Wake up. Like a dancer. I didn't wake up from the bed. Oh, everything hurts from the last day practice. He's not like that. <laughs> so after we wake up, we brush our teeth. Boom. I want you to do this with a nice posture and awareness of your center. Already you exercise your abdominal muscles. Then we go at work. We drive half an hour to get in those dancing studios. We don't want to drive like normal humans. Boom. Posture on. What's up? <laughs> posture up. Use the headdress again so you are able to actually practice your posture. Adjust your mirror, right? So you can see that, oh, when I slouch, I can see those mirrors. When I'm in posture, I can see them perfectly. So we really want you to find this simple, goofy stuff that is gonna improve your daily posture because it's important for your dancing and for your life. Do not have any health issues because you use your posture right and you don't just let gravity take you down, right? And of course, when you enter the dance studio or any place, even the grocery store, you don't wanna enter unconfident, zombie mode. You want to enter and be aware of your posture and body and look really confident, aware of your posture, holding up yourself, not just let life take you down and all the crazy things that happen every day. So we hope you enjoyed this little tutorial and you better practice those every single day. You better have a nice posture to save in chiropractor and massage therapist. Because we will see you Dancing out there. Dancing helps in everything. <laughs> Let's see humans with amazing posture. That's like, subscribe, push the belly button and the bell button, all that jazz. Because we want to see all of you transforming to dancers and living a better life. Thank you guys. Oh.